During a recent interview, Travis Kelsey's dad Ed Kelsey admitted that he has concerns about the future for the two highly successful lovebirds. I won't pretend that I don't worry about it. He is my son, and I worry about him because they will have some challenges in their relationship for sure, Ed said. But they seem a good fit and ultimately, they just need to find their way together. This comes after Travis Kelsey spent some time with his family asking his dad for some tips to keep a healthy relationship with his partner, Taylor. Since as the lovebirds have been disconnected for some time now, Travis Kelsey admitted he had a great time with his family, especially his dad, and is looking forward to more of those moments. I had a great time, trust me, it was wonderful. He smiled. There's never a boring time with them, especially when talking with my old man, you know. He has a lot of wisdom, so I always use that opportunity to gather as much wisdom I can from him. He laughs. However, with the Super Bowl now out of the way, Travis should have a relatively open diary throughout the NFL offseason until training camp with the Chiefs starts up in September. Meanwhile, after her stint in Sydney, Swift has six shows in Singapore before she has two months off. Turing then restarts on May 9th in Paris and Swift will be on the road until mid-August, by which point Kelsey will have returned to practice with the Chiefs for the new NFL season, which begins in early September. But Swift's tour dates could see Kelsey visit iconic sporting stadiums in Europe that she will be playing, such as Wembley, the home of England's national soccer team, and Anfield, the home of Liverpool, the Premier League team that share owners with the Boston Red Sox. The chief star could use his time in Britain to plan some adventures of his own as well. Recently, on the New Heights podcast that he co-hosts with his brother Jason, Travis suggested that they do live shows in Britain after learning they both have the top-selling NFL jerseys there. We gotta get over there, dude, the Chiefs tight end said. I feel like if this is what's going on in the UK, we gotta get a live show over there, dude. Jason replied, you ain't gotta talk me into that, I'd be very down for that. It was also reported in late December that Kelsey had made plans to visit Italian vineyards and top restaurants across Europe for when Swift is between tour dates. Kelsey recently faced backlash for partying in the wake of the shooting at the Chiefs' Super Bowl parade that left one woman dead and 22 injured. Kelsey was among the Chiefs' stars who went ahead with a scaled-down celebration just hours after a mass shooting saw the team's Super Bowl parade descend into tragedy. However, other teammates stayed away from the party. He did eventually match Taylor's donations to the GoFundMe page for the family of Lisa Lopez Galvin, who was killed by the gunfire. He made a pair of $50,000 donations from his charity, the 87 and Running Foundation. Just like haters gonna hate, Swifties are gonna swoon over Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's winning romance. The Kansas City Chiefs football player gave supporters of the couple plenty to warm their hearts after his team won a hard-fought Super Bowl game on Sunday night. Cameras captured Swift as she stood on the field near Kelsey's mom, Donna, waiting for the tight end to finish post-game interviews following a nail-biting Super Bowl 58 in which the Chiefs beat the San Francisco 49ers 25-22. Kelsey, in his championship era, made his way to the two most important women in his life, took off his hat as he kissed and embraced his mother first. He quickly pivoted to Swift and said, Come here, girl. The two embraced and exchanged several kisses. It felt like karma really is the guy on the Chiefs, a nod to one of Swift's most famous song lyrics. Cue Swifties losing it on social media. You can't blame them. Swift and Kelsey's love story has dominated this football season as much, if not more, than the Chiefs on the field. Taylor Swift caused traffic on Tuesday night when she stepped out for dinner in Sydney. The global superstar shocked onlookers at Pellegrino, a neighborhood Trattoria located in Surrey Hills. Taylor very gorgeous as she opted for a low-key black gypsy top paired with a brown suede skirt for the outing. Thanks for watching guys hope you enjoy the video. Well, that will be all for now. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button to view more of my videos thank you.